Today, the sun, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. The next yellow thing is a yellow flower. I love flowers. Do you see a yellow flower anywhere? Oh, you do see the flower? Where is it? Here's our yellow flower. It smells so good. Now I just need to find one more thing. A yellow banana. I don't see it anywhere. Hmm. If I were a banana, where would I be? Somewhere nice and cozy with all my friends. Aha! The banana was hiding with all its fruit friends. Who? Who? It's Ollie! Hello, Luca. Who? Who? Finding things that are yellow, are you? Oh, hi, Ollie. This banana was the last thing to find in my yellow scavenger hunt. Yellow is bright and fun. It's true. I know who made yellow things for me and you. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through who? I've got a Bible story for me and you. <gasps> well, hello, everyone. I'm Aisha, and welcome to my cupcake food truck. Check out today's special. Ta-da! <laughs> They're my whole world cupcakes. They're for our story today because it's all about how God made the whole world and everything in it. If you're ready for a story, on the count of three, yell, tell me a story. One, two, three, tell me a story. Today's true story from the Bible is all about how God made the whole world. Make a world with your hands like this. <gasps> Good job! Look at all those worlds. Put your hands down now. God made the whole world and everything in it. Everything! On day one, God made the light and the dark. And on day two, God made sky above the water. But was God done yet? On day three, God made land. Now there was land. And God gathered the waters together and called them seas. Then God created things to start growing on all the land. God grew fruit trees and grass and flowers. There were so many beautiful plants. God saw what he had made and God said, that's good. Everyone say, that's good with me. That's good. But God wasn't done yet. On day four, God made a light for the day and a light for the night. Hmm, what light shines in the sky during the day? Do you know? <laughs> the sun. The sun shines in the sky during the day. That's right. God made the sun to brighten up our days and help plants grow and keep us warm. 
and he made a light for the night. What glows in the sky at night? <laughs> yes, the moon. The moon comes out at night and God added lots and lots of little lights up in the night sky. Do you know what they are called? Stars, yes. God filled the night sky with stars. On day four, God made the sun, moon, and stars. God saw what he had made and God said, that's good. Everyone say, that's good with me. That's good. Now, let's remember everything God made. On day one, God made light and dark. On day two, God made sky over the water. On day three, God made land, plants, and sea. On day four, God made the sun, moon, and stars. One more time. Day one, light and dark. Day two, sky over water. <laughs> day three, land, plants, and sea. Day four, the sun, moon, and stars. But God wasn't done yet because God made everything. Did you like the story? If you did, give it two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. <laughs> oh, hey there, Ollie, tell me, who made everything? God made everything. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who made everything? God made everything. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Bye. So there's your story, and it's all true. God made the land, plants, and sea, and the sun, moon, and stars, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Ooh. Ooh. Wow, God made all the land, and plants, and sea, and God made the sun, and moon, and stars, too. God made everything. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good. Hey, God made this yummy yellow banana. And I'm going to have it for my snack. See you next time. Bye.